How are you going to turn that team fight around? Oh, yeah. All right. Well, for that oh, one, there's nice. more battles going in. Uh, honestly, you, this might end up you. being a kill. Oh, they popped ah, the shrine. Is. Good play right there. And now maybe oh, Dylan in a little bit of trouble. All right. The shrine plays are a thing. <laughs> are they going to kill off the IO because of that? I think they might. Oh, oh, fairy fire so void it's available need another hit is it going to be enough damage yes oh. they get the kill yeah still daytime there's no way to slow down any of these guys oh goodness oh god mercy <laughs> oh, shrined it two of them caught out kalu taking the damage they also have the viper strike now onto the tiny but they toss them back into the rest of the team this might be enough the impale is available again in one second can they hit it they do not dead as of yet but close there's the toss of the io and they find the kill on the high ground they have the bat rider flame break so fast <laughs> Uh, now impaled. Oh, Lucent Beam. They're starting to slow him up, and, well, Global is going to come out, but I think that it might not be enough, honestly. They're already tethered up there, and in the midst of all of them, Tiny throws out the Avalanche, connects onto two. Eclipse is going to be there as well. They don't have that much vision, though, because of nighttime, and now duel up the Luna. I don't know if they're going to be able to do it, though. They relocate away immediately. Good reactions there by the IO. Hanskin making it work. Food EGM getting controlled as well. He is going to die. But that is all I think that they lose in this fight. Uh, Io relocate, gets away. No, he's gone. For an overcharge going? I I don't know. I'm a little bit terrified, but I guess for now at least they're gonna go on to the Nyx Assassin. Global Silence comes out. They're actually able to duel right off the bat. The Luna. They need to get around. There's a ton of damage, and they do end up bringing down the Luna. A huge kill coming out before the BKB is online. Tiny drops as well. Now looking to take down EGM. He is going to be able to TP out. In the meantime, they're going to relocate back over this side. It does look like Viper is going to be able to escape. He just walks away. All right, no, he's, he's super dead. Gem is there. Aegis down. Can they get into position to help him out in time? I don't think so. Global Silence is available. They drop it, decide to turn, see if they can fight. Or maybe just make an escape. TP not available. Shadow Blade off cooldown soon. Flame break away, but no. Eclipse comes out. I don't know if it's going to be enough. They do end up turning it back around. Take down the Bat Rider. Okay. Alliance making things. On the Viper. They're, they're thinking about this one. They're going in for it. All right. They need to relocate in very quickly. The relocate is starting to come. Global Silence comes out as well. BKB popped immediately, but they got the duel off. So oh, Lena, no. not, or Luna not going to be able to get the Eclipse right off the bat. They are going to be able to turn this now, though, onto the Legion Commander. Legion is gone. So, so far, Legion for Ogre. Nyx Assassin also falls. The rest realize that... The Radiant are there. They jump forward, though, able to catch on to one. Is it enough damage, though? Doesn't look like it as if yet. Luna turns, starts to right-click the Bat Rider. There isn't a great way for Bat to get out of this one. And, well, with the right-clicks coming in, that's going to be a kill. Meanwhile, the Tiny chasing down the uh, Silencer. And, yeah, he's going to drop as well. Where's the rest of the backup? Legion is not in this fight. And, well, it looks like they want to try and go in again. Viper is about to wear off Shadow Blade. Are they going to try and go for something ratty? It looks like instead they're just going to try and take down the uh, ogre real quickly, but I don't even know if that's super possible. They get the silence, relocate forward. This feels very sloppy by OG. I, I don't know if it's going to be enough. I guess that in the meantime, you do have the Legion Commander who's ratting up in the top lane and type things going on, but I mean, I guess Legion takes the tier 3 tower and will only have to yeah, give up Rome. Luna, though. There's no way. Moon Shard now picked up. She is so big. Still doesn't have the BKB in the inventory as of yet, but doesn't really feel the need to as of yet. God, look at the damage. It's absurd. Meanwhile, jump in on the back line. They're going to be able to catch Yapsor, and he is just gone yet again. They do catch the duel, are going to be able to catch it onto the IO. Not sure if it's enough damage, though. And meanwhile, Luna is still large and in charge. This is feeling very difficult. Eclipse is available, holds on to it for a second, and then decides to back out. Going forward again. I hope it buys back, relocates in, keeping the Luna alive. Turning now. So they don't want to overextend. And this is just going to be relocating Luna back home, I think. Yeah, they're out of there. So far had 52 kills. I feel like that jumps has to be forward. Oh, Duel. Oh. All right, big combo there, bringing the Luna down very low. Is she going to die? They do get the kill. Legion also pays for it, though. Now, wow, on top what a of lasso. them. That was really well played. They're going to be able to control up that IO, and yeah, no way for him to save the Luna there. Yapsor still chasing, wanting to bring down this 
Tiny and might just be able to do it nice and pale there. Following it up with the Avatos combination, the Absorb dropping low, Ignite goes out as well. But now you have Ender in the area, but they are going to be able to get out with the Tiny. So they saved the gem. Oh, immediately smoke broken by the Night Stalker. Nicely played there. Uh, okay, damage being dealt right now onto the Ogre. Meanwhile, they jump forward. There's the Lasso pulling in the Tiny. They've also dueled up the Luna. They're going to end up losing both their cores here in a second. They bring her down, get the dual damage victory. Tiny does manage to bring down that Silencer, but I don't know if it's ended up being enough. They jump forward again, trying to continue to chase out this Tiny. The rest of the battle is really spread out. Can they find the kill on the Legion? They do get her, but I think that you're still going to end up losing this Tiny off the back of it. So three go down for Alliance. Lead is Batrider, he can have all the vision for the night time. Oh, they're going in. Oh, trying to find him. Is Aegis. In some trouble. They are going to control, but they gets the self-lasso now, and they duel again oh. onto Loda. No way to stop it. They're going to try and relocate out. They do manage to, but still maintains the duel. They get the kill, and now looking for a little bit more. They save the global silence. Oh, Void now out as well onto the Tiny, and he does go for the BKB. They try and toss away and keep that Nyx alive. A little bit of a helping hand right there. But man, again, Loda go. <laughs> Ain't <laughs> She's the way. gonna die now. You jinxed her, man. God, they're going in for it though. This this tower is gonna fall so quickly, or they're just gonna go for a really sick initiation. And they do find Yapsor there. Ignite comes out. Ender is up on the high ground now. They do also have the Bat Rider able to pull on the one. That's Aghanim Scepter initiation as well. In some trouble. Duel is there, and actually it's gonna be a double duel reflected in on top of each other. Can they find this kill? It's gonna be a lot of damage going oh back. My. Oh, they gave it all over to the Luna, and now trying to find the kill. Is it gonna be enough there? They take down Ender. Triple kill for Loda. They didn't actually get the dual victory for the Luna. That would have been to see awful. How much, yeah, I wanted to see how much damage that would have given. That would have given 116 damage because it was double dual because of the Lotus Orb. <laughs> All right. That was a scary moment. <laughs> That's still a scary moment right now for OG. Alliance are coming in strong. And... Say what you will about him. He's a he's a big old strong guy right now, hitting on these towers. The barracks are gone. Nowhere left to hide. How are OG gonna deal with this? They don't have buyback on the Batrider. This is gonna be mega creeps. Can they hold though? I, I think if you're if you're alliance, you just need to keep it going right now. You, you, you can't give him an opportunity to get back into this game. All right, buyback on Viper is available. They don't have it on Batrider. They're going to buyback on Viper. Jump four. Tons of damage being dealt. They need to find this kill really badly. Oh, relocate away. They break the duel. Ender is still there up front and center trying to take down food. And, man, what a relocate right there by the IO. They need Refresher now on Legion just so he gets his free duel damage. <laughs> yeah, they got to get I'm really that. surprised on the enemy. <laughs> oh, duel forward. They found Luna again, but... They don't have enough to break this, and Legion is just going to die. They again find the kill. Batrider going to be able to blink out, but... The duel is lost. It's just at the trail end. Oops. I'm not sure. That's kind of what I was wondering as well, but regardless... It bugged. I, you're looking at this, and that is going to be Viper going down. Good game, finally called. And Alliance bring it back to a game number three. Ryu, what are you thinking? Where, where are we going to go? I'm not even sure anymore.